right, so we are going to talk about selecting and requesting courses for your upcoming year. When you first start out, you want to head to the BMR High School homepage, which you can go right ahead and type in www.bmrhs.com, and this will bring you to the homepage. The students will need to access the X2 themselves. Do not use the parent portal. Sometimes that happens. So in order to do that, the students will go to the Students tab. They will drag all the way down to My BMR SD. Click on that link. This will direct you to a new page. At the top, it'll say My BMR SD. Click on the link, Students. Scroll down to X2 and click on that. This will bring you to the X2 homepage. Here you will go ahead and enter in your student ID, which you should have already received. Enter in the username and password and click log on. Once that opens up, you want to click on the tab My Info. Then you want to scroll down to the bottom left and click on the tab Request. At this page, you will see every subject area represented. Also, you should have seen what your teachers have recommended to you. We went ahead and cleared this student's schedule out as we have already made her schedule, but you can go ahead and pick the courses you'd prefer. You always want your core courses, English, Math, Science, and History. You can go ahead and pick your foreign language, PE, or any other electives that you need to fulfill the BMR graduation requirements. For the student, you can click on English, click the tab Select, and we're just waiting for a pop-up window to appear, and here it is. For every level, the courses that you are able to select should be noted for you. Since the student is a junior going to be a senior, these are the courses that she is eligible to take. If you're a freshman, your courses will look a little bit different, same for being a sophomore or junior. So I know the student is interested in taking multicultural literature, so I'm going to go ahead and click as if I were the student, Multicultural Literature, and then click OK at the bottom. Once you see that, you will notice that the request has appeared on the main screen. I'm gonna go ahead and select the rest of her courses for her. I click on Select under the Art Subject Area. Click the course Advanced Ceramics. Checked it off, so I'm gonna click OK. I know she wants to take video production. So I clicked on the Tech tab, checked off Video Production, click OK again, and then I'm going to do the same for the rest of the courses. Then at the bottom, if for some reason a course wasn't appearing or maybe a course re was requested by your teacher and you weren't interested, you can go ahead and write a note for the counselor to see. For instance, a student wanted to know if they could take Street Law. So I'll go ahead and write, I was wondering if I could also take street law. This will notify the counselor that maybe we need to make an override or see if we can switch something in their schedule to hopefully make this work. After your notes have been put in and after you've selected all your courses, on the bottom left, you wanna click this post button. Once you click that post button, your counselor will be able to see it on their end of X2, which will appear differently. Other than that, you are all set. You should look forward to having a meeting with your counselor if you are currently in the high school and talk about your schedule there. If you're an eighth grader, you can have your parent call or you can email the guidance counselors up at the high school and they will certainly help you out. Other than that, good luck and uh, hope we get your schedule for next year.